Hello everyone and welcome to your third note play along. This is the sheet that says your third note up at the top and um, I'm going to use a flute to record. I'll, I'll promise I will switch instruments for the next batch um, but for right now I'm going to use a flute and let's run through what notes uh, these are for everybody. It's kind of interesting that it's different for each instrument um, but it's the way the instruments are built. Sometimes you have to play different letters to all sound the same. Um, all right, so for flute, the note we're going to play is D. That is the same note for trombone, baritone, tuba, and percussion on your xylophone. For um, clarinet, you're actually going to play a C on this one. And for trumpet and horn, you're going to E. Uh, it just has to do with how many fingers the clarinet went. I just kind of switched the order on those a little bit. For saxophone, you are going to be playing B for this one. All right, let's give it a try. Quick review, we know um, we see a whole note there on the first song. A whole note's an open circle like that, kind of like an oval, and it, um, that note lasts for four counts. It takes up the whole measure in four, four time. Uh, same thing with the rest that comes after, that's a whole rest, and we wait for four counts. Let's try this song together. Here's my metronome. I'm at about 90, nope, I'm sliding. I'm at about 95 right now. That's a nice moderate speed to try this. Here we go. One, two, ready, play. Four, and the song is done. Nice job. I hope that went well for you. You can always pause and practice for a second or even rewind and play it again. Let's move on to the second song. So our oval has had a stem added to it, either um, going up or going down. Like I keep saying, it doesn't matter. It's just based on where it is on the staff. Um, for saxophone, this is your first one that points down. You've seen some that have pointed up. Um, a half note is half of a whole note. A whole note lasts four counts, so a half note is two counts. Um, and you have two of them in the measure because two plus two is four, and that's how many counts are in a measure. I'm doing math. So you're going to play those half notes for two counts each. They will sound like... My head just went one, two, three, four, but we can also use the metronome to help us with that. That's the first line. The second line, you see four notes in the measure, and they've been colored in. Those are quarter notes, and a quarter note lasts for one count. It's a quarter of a whole note. Those are fractions. There's a little bit of math in band. Nothing wrong with that. So you're going to play each of those for one count. Let's try this song. Here's the metronome. One, two, three, go. Excellent. I hope that went well for you, but as always, if it didn't, leave me a message on the classroom or um, ask me in your lesson. Please get in touch with me, and uh, if you have any problems, I'm happy to help out. I hope you have a wonderful time practicing. Thank you.